let's see about this anchor. I haven't used this, but it's, it's, I don't know. It actually looks like a little bomb to me. Oh, what, what? We have a connection, it seems. Oh, I'm still connected? Yes, I'm still connected. What? Uh, sh shift, jump. Ooh, we can fly. Oh my God, do we have an attack for that? Oh yeah, he actually has. What? Whee! Oh, that's cool. I wonder how good, oh, it's, it's done. I guess it has a maximum amount of uses. Funny. Oh, oh no! <laughs> what a wonderful night in Minato. Isn't this great? Yeah, it's a little bit too... <laughs> too bright, to be honest. But okay, we have a full moon, right? So yeah, actually, I think we always have a full moon. <laughs> Who cares? What is today? Oh, uh, actually, actually, welcome back, everybody. <laughs> welcome back to Wild Hearts. Yes, I know. I know, there's at least one request I've completed that I have to report back. Yeah, yeah, I, I know that. But look at this. I made a hammer out of a bird. Yeah, it's actually a bird hammer. I made this out of um, raven parts. Doesn't look very raven-like, but it, it is it, it is a raven. Believe me, it, it's a fucking raven hammer. Oh. And it's, it's pretty cool. It's raw damage. And we're gonna use this big bad boy against Mr. Plume, Mr. Amp Plume, because he's the first one we're gonna hunt today on the Spirit Island. After that one, I guess we might go for Golden Tempest next. Maybe do a side quest or two. Don't know. Don't know. Not sure. But but today is Amber Plume Day, so let's go. Let's go, guys. Let's get a fucking going. Ooh, he's right over there. Oh, that's very close. Cool. Nice. Yeah, everything's ready. Oh, no, I forgot something. I forgot to change my threat. Okay, he's right over there. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a bit silly to make him a question mark, even so we already know his name and stuff, but who cares, right? <laughs> Let's see. Do we get a cinematic for him? I hope so. Please, Mr. Bird. He's just like spine glider sitting up there. Come on. Get down here. Get down here, Mr. Bird. Oh yeah, here we go, here we go. Nice. <laughs> the blue fire is really cool. And he, I'm, I still think he looks like he was made up of snakes. But okay. Five star red kimono, okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. You have no chill, buddy, huh? Let's give him a harpoon. Maybe two. Yeah, okay, he shoots fire. Whoa, whoa! He does pink flames as well? Are you crazy? Of course. Oh no, oh no, ow. He is fast. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Ow. Um. Oh no, oh no. Oh, oh my god, that hurts. He's dealing so much damage. Come on. Come on, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Bam. Nice! Oh no, I missed that one. Oh god, in rage. What are we getting? Oh my god. Oh my god, he's. Wow. That wasn't cool. Whoa! <laughs> he has a freaking laser beam. What the fuck, buddy? Oh my. What? Whoa! Um, Epsilon, Q, Epsilon, Epsilon, Q, Epsilon? What did we get? Oh, man, what? Um, okay. A Celestial Shield Fusion Karakuri just flashed into existence. That's... 
cool, I guess. <laughs> what does it do? It's gone already. What does it do? You guys can absorb a single attack from a kimono. Use a two row celestial anchor. Create celestial anchor fusion to create it. Okay, okay. Where's he going? Are you a runner? I thought you would be a flyer. Seriously, his tail feathers totally look like snake tubes and he has a big one in the middle. What's what's wrong with his tail? I want to break his tail to see how it looks. We'll break it. <laughs> okay, let's do that shield thing again. Yeah, he's enraging anyways. Okay, what was that? It was anchor box. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay. I got it. Oh, cool. Okay, so we have a little bubble. Oh, it didn't. Hmm. What? It didn't hit me. Oh, no. Ah. Uh, oh, my God. It's getting. Are they getting bigger? Come on, get him, get him, get him. Yes. I didn't even see what he was doing there. Again, 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 again. Yeah. No, whoa. Okay. Uh huh. <laughs> he missed me, but I didn't see what he was doing. That. that laser is so cool. Boing. Let's use the hunter's arm. And mine. <laughs> Mr. Bloom? What is he doing? Oh my god. Whoa, that one is scary as fuck. Seriously? Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Ow. What? What? They didn't. Whoa. That hurt. But not that much. I was expecting more. Ow. Shoot. What? When he rammed into me, he got repelled like from a. Like from, from a, a barricade. What? What? That's crazy! And it's on me! Oh, I think he's exhausted. Come on, come on, knock him out! Knock him out! Nah, didn't work. Maybe... No, that won't hit him. That won't hit him. Normally it doesn't hit. No. No. <laughs> I think he's close to death already. What the fuck? I don't even have a, a damage gear up. Oh, I think this time is the final time. He go into the air last time? No, he doesn't. Shit. Waste. There. Ah. I'm pretty sure I don't want to get hit by this laser. Ah, shoot, shoot, shoot. That already hurts enough, yeah. Like, more than enough. Uh, ah. 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 Oh, my gosh. It's not that much damage, actually. Whoa! But I feel those big blasts. Yeah, I really do. Like the big fireballs he does, those those uh, purple ones. They are really scary. Oh yeah, threat, 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 give me threat. Da. Is he exhausted? No, no, no. He's doing, what? Ah, he's doing it. Ow! Okay, he changed targets. He changed targets in the midst of his cast. You're a fucking fire mage. Don't like you. Oh no. <laughs> yeah.
No. Oh my god. Heal. Heal. No. Oh wow. Okay. My restrike saved me. No. Oh my. No. 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 Oh, thanks, Big Rock. Wow. That was. That was really threatening. What? What was that hit? I don't know. Let's try and break his tail. If that even is possible. That didn't hit me. Ow. Oh, now, now he does the frame flow. Frame, frame, flame thrower. Get it. Get it! Nice. Okay. So he's not that much of a melee guy. Oh, we're gonna get him. Yes, nice. Pull him down, pull him down. Yeah. We... What? what? They just turned black? We broke them? What? He's done. He's fucking done. Okay. I think we broke the tail, yeah. Amber plume wing feathers. Wing feathers? No, we broke the wings, not the tail. What the fuck? Okay, let's have a good look at him. <laughs> Mr. Plume. Seriously, that totally lo looks like... Actually, it looks like worms. Is your face made of worms? That's a little bit disgusting. His tail... It's so crazy that they turned black all of a sudden. Look at this, it's a fucking tube. He has fucking tubes as tail. That's... yeah. What the fuck? What is wrong with you? You're an interesting creature. And he has feathers. Now oh, look at this. Yeah, he's, he's the worms as well. He's made out of worms! It's a worm bird! Maybe you ate too many worms and that turned you into a worm bird then? And you were just a, a magic peacock before that? I don't know. But you, you don't look to be very happy, to be honest. So um, I'm gonna kill you now. Thanks for the fight, Mr. Plume. And off you go! Boing. Yeah, this will be a very short episode. <laughs> Fire skin display feathers. Interesting. I wonder what his armor will look like. Yay! Would this dialogue switch if we killed Golden Tempest first? I don't know. I don't know. But okay, let's go back, have a look at his armor. <laughs> okay, cool hat. A Garuda hat. Death ears and solar protection. Wait, solar protection? Attack and defense in daylight hours. Okay, by 5%. Yeah, I have the same from... from this one this, this is lunar protection but it it has it doesn't have re fatigue recovery okay arm is about the same <clears throat> but this one self-control and desperation also blaze resilience self-control and only a single life that remains okay cool so yeah we actually fuck up too much Boosts stamina recovery speed. Hmm. Reduces defense but boosts attack. Hmm. So more damage. More desperation. Critical draw. Vengeance. It's vengeance. Boosts attack briefly after being hit by a kimono. Yeah, actually you don't want to be hit by the kimono. <laughs> Boots. Self-control. Again. Wait, was that again? Okay. And strong arm spirit and a health boost. I think that's okay for an endgame armor. Very kimono based. Let's see what the kimono armor looks like. That looks... That mask looks fucking silly, sorry. <laughs> oh, that's cool. With those feathers. This one actually looks better with the fur. I think. Uh, yeah, actually, this one looks actually cooler. Like, this is... I think the first time that the normal one looks better than the kimono. Okay. Duh. <laughs> okay, yeah, that one's silly. 
Like, you're actually in your undergarb. <laughs> this is, I guess, the sexy dancer armor in this game for, for the girls. I'm sorry to tell you that, but in every game there is a sexy dancer armor. At least one. It's common. I feel bad because of that. <laughs> but okay. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Uh, I think they nailed it. Um, that's a very good armor. Like, a lot of armors don't look a lot like the animal you beat for it. Um, some are just straight up clothing and some are just way too silly. But actually, I think that's okay. <laughs> that was a, a nice hunt. Um, I hope that Golden Tempest is, will put up more of a fight. That would be great. Um... But I guess we're going to see about that next episode. It's still night time. We beat him before the night was over. Nice. <laughs> but okay, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. I hope to see you all next time for another another um, episode of Wild Hearts. And until then, I wish all of you a great, a great time. See you next time. And bye-bye.